We've got some breaking news. Local high school teen associated with doing questionably humorous openers on screen again. More on this at 7. But for now, computer science, careers, and moose on sports. With all this and more, keep watching. This is the Cat's Eye News. Email us at nhscatseyenews at gmail.com with your story ideas and we'll be sure to feature it on our next broadcast. Be sure to send it to this email and not Mr. Latart for the best chances of seeing your email. See you later, Novi. What's up, Novi? Red Cross is having a blood drive this week on May 2nd. Whether you want to volunteer or donate blood, the signups are available through their Schoology pages, but you have to be over 16 to donate with parent permission. If you're interested, join their Schoology group and go check it out. Hey, Novi, next week on Tuesday, May 7th, right after school in room 160, the Crochet Interest Group and the Classical Music Interest Group will be hosting their first joint meeting. They'll be making flower coasters for Mother's Day, and it'll be a nice opportunity to relax and take a break from your AP test studying. Snacks will be provided, so if you're interested, fill out the QR code on the side here. Hey Novi, the Photography Interest Group is having their next meeting on Friday, May 3rd from 3 to 4 p.m. in MC Lab 1, right across from room 182. They will be using Adobe Photoshop to edit pictures and more. Hope to see you there. Hey Novi, this is Luke, back again to give you some news about AMCC, the Applied Mathematics and Computing Club. They'll be having their next meeting this Thursday, May 2nd, in room 261. They'll be going over AP Computer Science concepts and reviewing practice tests. Anybody is welcome, even if you're not in the class. So make sure to show up if you're planning on taking the class or just taking the AP test. And as always, this is Luke, signing off. Seniors, if you're interested in playing in the staff for senior softball game on May 10th, sign up with the QR code below. Sign up will stop after the first 10 girls and the first 10 boys have signed up. What's up, Novi? The three of us and Chase will be attending the Novi High School Construction Day field trip today. A whole lot of trucks and a whole lot of careers and mud. We'll update you with how it goes and what we do there this Friday, so stay tuned for that. Hi, I'm Moose, and this is your weekly Wildcat Sports Wrap for last week. Boys baseball split against Seahome and took two wins against Plymouth. Girls softball split against Plymouth and took two losses against Stevenson and Heartland. Girls lacrosse dominated last week with three wins against Stevenson, Lakeland, and Canton. This puts them at number six in Division I and number 11 in the state. Girls soccer took a loss to Northville and tied against both Royal Oak and Salem. And last but not least, our girls and boys varsity track and field teams both beat Plymouth in their Tuesday meets. A special shout out to the girls varsity tennis team for beating Northville last week. And an additional shout out to the JV tennis team who are currently undefeated. Thank you all for watching and stay tuned for this week's wrap up on Friday. This has been the Cat's Eye News. Thank you and goodbye.